Hello? Mike speaking. Hi, Mike. How are you? What? Good lord! I have a day off after spending a week in the OC and the first thing I hear is you being fired? Is it true what the boys said? Don't know what they've said. That the boss fired you because you were messing with that affair? That thing about your parents? Yeah. Yeah? You're on probation for it. Christ! The list of rules you violated won't fit into the yellow pages. And for what? I tell you, it's not true. No sniper with a custom-built rifle killed your parents 15 years ago. Hey, Mike, if that's all, you better hang up. Okay, okay. You know, I'm your friend. It's only... You see, you're the first man I know to be fired from the agency. If you need anything. Yeah, I do. What is it? There are some documents mailed from MI5. Oh, Christ. I need you to take them before anyone notices. You're kidding me. Will you do it? Oh, yes. Sure I will. I should have the results of a comparison test at ballistics. Well, if anyone finds out what I do, I'm going to be the second man I know to be far from the agency. And then I am dead, because Miriam will kill me. Well, I'll give you a call when I'm done. Yeah, and... And, and what? Should I arrange world peace, feed the hungry, or something like that? And thanks. Christ, you're welcome. If only I hadn't called you. See ya. Hi, Mike. Hi, you're here. It's open. Yeah, I peeked into it a bit. Professional curiosity, you know. Hmm. Man, I'm starting to believe you. How did you find out that the British seized this weapon shipment? By chance? Yeah, sure. And you were fired because the Chief had nothing more interesting to do. But that sniper rifle is not the one. Do you see the lines on this bullet? The other bullet doesn't have them. Whatever. I remember it. It's altered in the same way, so the same man must have done it. It's a clue. You don't give up. You want to go to Belfast and find out the origin of these weapons? Uh, no, I'm not going anywhere. Are you sure? Hmm. Well, your wife may congratulate herself she didn't marry you. Bill, please, take this. Of course, sir. Bill, don't go inside. Wait for me here at the gate. We're leaving soon. No. Oh, yeah. Hi, Joe. You owe me from La Hotteville. Ah, uh, you? I thought you'd call. I'd heard you'd been fired from the CIA. Yeah. So what is it now? Usual stuff. I'm going to Belfast. Usual stuff? I'm going to Belfast. 
Sure, no problemo. Hey, I have a tank here. Good as new. You might find it useful. Maybe. Oh, is it that bad? It will be that bad. Yeah? Peter Milligan? Who is this? Michael Wise told me to contact you. Oh, it's you. Mike told me you'd call. And can you help? Well, 14 days after MI5 seized the weapon shipment, British soldiers stepped up security measures and closed the checkpoints. But I've heard about a new weapon shipment on the way. And this one has a name. John O'Rory. He's IRA. Last known address is 30 Bishop Street, Belfast. And he's the man behind the weapon shipments? Not likely. O'Rory is just a contact, a middle guy. The man you really want is Sean Mines. I'll start with Aurori then. <laughs> 